Hello everybody. We're here today at the Hilo Airport. We just went for a flight with pilot Scott Wilson up to uh, Holly Mau Mau to check out the new lake that is kind of forming in the bottom of the crater there. Lake now, of water. Yeah, lake of water. The whole situation up there is incredible just with the massive changes in the last year going from lava lake to the giant collapses and eruption in the 2018 eruption in the Lower East Rift Zone, now to the uh, of water appearing in the bottom of the crater. It really has, yeah. I mean, today I was, uh, I was commenting to you earlier, we're actually up in a plane, that it's uh, one year since the last collapse right. of the Summit exactly Caldera, right? Year, the very last, last one. one that happened we had 62 was a year ago today. Yep. Um, and one year later, here we are uh, flying over, um, checking out the water in a new pit, right? So, fascinating. From the air and in person, I think it's a lot easier to tell that it's really actually water. It's right. very reflective. You can kind of see as you move through the sky, the actual reflection changing, right? Because, you know, there is some coloration on the bottom of the pond. It's hard to really say for sure. Oh, it's not the silt underneath there or some mud uh, that's giving it a kind of appearance. But it was really more convincing in person. And it's really hard to get video because the actual pit of water is so small compared to how high you need to be in the air to, to fly right. over there, right? We're for You gotta 4, have to zoom feet. in uh, on the cameras to be able to get any kind of, but now it's at the point where you can actually see it with the naked eye. Now we really can see a noticeable change in the size and the extent of that first puddle, now pond. Right. Um, as it grows over time. So we're definitely gonna keep an eye on that as it evolves over time. Right. The USGS photograph released yesterday um, from where they actually found a spot on the ground to go and actually see this thing. They saw a spot that was steaming behind the main pond when they speculated that it was probably water trying to come in. Right. And it was so hot that it was steaming first. And we actually saw the water pooled on the ground today. We'll be doing further updates on this as more information comes through, including USGS's estimations on this whole process. So we'll kind of, you know, keep you guys up to date on this new lake coming into the Big Island. For sure, yeah, we'll keep watching. Yeah, and um, day by day as it fills up, we'll pass you guys uh, what information we know, what images we have. And at some right. point we'll kind of compile it so you guys can kind of see the progress a little more. Um... All right. All right, guys. So thanks for joining us. Yes, thank you. Stay classic, Stay classic Kuna. Kuna.